Bo here. This dog is a running fool. Go inside. Take a little break. Howdy, 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 everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here today. I wanted to do a little bit of a different video, quite frankly, because A, I think it's a good video to do, and B, we're not really doing anything crazy here at the house today. Blue has the day off. We've been riding him just about every day here for the past week or so. He's uh, really coming back into shape, getting his endurance back, getting his legs up underneath him. We're actually gonna be going to a team roping practice tomorrow. I'll probably just run the sled, but we may run a few, you never know. Look at these two. One of my biggest pet peeves when it comes to horses is when people tie their horses improperly. Um, so I'm gonna put the GoPro on my head real quick. I'm gonna show you how I tie this horse and that horse and that one down there and uh, i would like your input so leave me a comment in the comment section below how do you tie your horse whether it's a specific name or a description of how you tie it i think that'd be very very cool very very interesting especially because we have quite a few people on this channel that are new to horses and horsemanship hi miss thing what a good boy walking over to me good boy Hi, buddy. We're gonna take the tail. It gets flipped over the rail. And we're gonna pull it down and through. Okay, just like that. Now with my right hand, I'm gonna grab this one and I'm gonna twist. Okay, puts a little coil into it. And this goes on the right side of this main line. Next thing I'm gonna do is with my left hand, I'm gonna feed this portion through the coil. And then I actually put a little bit of a twist in it as well. Now, then you just take the main one and cinch it down, right? Then all you do is pull it through the coil, just like that. Reason I do that is because if he, now this horse, very, very good horse, yes you are, he has very rarely ever set back. I think he's only set back one time. But if I needed to grab and let him loose of this in a hurry, hey buddy, I'm trying to show the nice people at home. If I needed to grab him in a hurry, all I've got to do is grab this tail piece. Because as soon as I grab and pull, he's free. This is a super simple and fast tie to do. You can literally do it in just a second, right? And now this is super loose and it's not gonna be hard for him to kind of maneuver out of, but he's not a Houdini or anything like that. He's not an escape artist. Okay, so let's show you again. Right hand, make a coil. Left hand, make a coil, pull it tight. And now you can just make coils like that so it gets it up off the ground. He can yank as hard blue. He can yank as hard as he wants on this side and it's not going to come loose. And as hard as I just pulled on that right there, I can still yank this and let him free in a hurry. Hopefully you like that way, you like that method. Let me know in the comments below what kind of knot do you tie your horses on and uh, what's it called? Where does it come from? I'm always fascinated to learn what other people are doing. If you have any questions, put them in the comments below. And like always, ladies and gentlemen, like this video, leave us a comment, and make sure that you subscribe. Share it with your friends and family. We're getting so close to 4,000 subscribers, and uh, I'm super happy about it, super excited about it. Hope you guys are enjoying this content. We'll see you next time.